Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel and welcome back to another video. So you guys, I am home for the summer and that means projects. Projects around this house that I'm not able to do when I'm working in the school system August through June. So July, the end of June, all of July and the first part of August is all about the projects. Cleaning, decluttering and all of the things. So today, is summer project number one and i'm going to be tackling my in-home office space now if you've been with me for any length of time you know we have a three bedroom two bath one car garage ranch style home we do not have a space in this house for a separate office or a library so those spaces uh live in my living room i have bookshelves which i don't have enough bookshelves just fyi um, I need actually a couple more bookshelves. And then I found this wonderful piece at the Restore, Habitat Restore. And it is an armoire that actually opens out into a desk area. It probably was more like an entertainment system. But this has a fold-out desk. And so I want to be able to utilize this space. But there is just one small, tiny, teeny-weeny, minute problem. I am what Cass from Clutterbug calls the classic cricket. If I don't have time to tackle the project, I'm going to put it behind a closed door until I'm able to get to the project, which is what I have done in this space. So I'm going to show you this space. And you've seen it before, but y'all, I mean, honestly, I've got to make some hard choices and decisions and get rid of some stuff. It's just team too much. So I'm gonna show you what this looks like. Please don't judge. I work a lot. I now have my mom. I've got my kids. We all do in Taekwondo. So some things just get shoved in here until I am able to get them taken care of. But I do wanna show you what it looks like and then bring you along as I get some cleaning done. Okay, you guys, so this is the armoire. I ended up paying $45 for this and then they, uh, delivered it so I think it was an extra five or ten dollars but here is okay before I open this say to yourself self and yourself needs to say hmm, no judgment please <laughs> I'm going to clean this and I'm gonna live my best life okay ah, oh, you guys look at this this is just horrible it's absolutely horrible I don't think I have used my um, desk or office area in golly months I've used it just to shove things in but that's it I haven't used it it's not usable because I just have so much stuff and I've got to make some hard like I said some hard and tough choices and I need to do that now also in addition to that this area has begun to explode. This is not a normal area in my home, but these are lots of the things that I'm doing reviews for or I have done reviews for, and now I have to find homes for things. I actually have two reviews I gotta do in this box. And then there's that lovely calendar that I got from Goodwill that I wanna use so that I can schedule out all of my YouTube stuff. That's why I bought it specifically to schedule out for YouTube. So I am going to try to hang this, probably not on this side of the cabinet, but I do think I'm going to try to hang it on this side so that when I walk past it, I'm able to see it. I am not a minimalist, but I don't like a lot of clutter either. So this right now is tending to bother me just a tiny bit. So I'm going to just bring you along and we're going to chit chat while I go through and clean out this mess there's got to be a better way friends something okay friends so this is the the things right i'm going to chit chat with you as I kind of go through some of these things because it is just the honest truth is honestly if I don't have time to deal with it I just uh, a 
okay, I don't deal with it. I put it behind this cabinet because I can close the doors and then I will deal with it when I have time to deal with it. And I just have not had enough time to sit down and deal with some things. So I'm just going to, and then some of this stuff is my son's because my son gets his mail delivered here to our house. So I've got to go through and figure out my stuff versus his stuff. And then the stuff I really can throw away. So I'm going to get Jackson to go and grab mom a trash can or trash bag. And we're going to go through. So I got a lot happening here, but there's also a lot happening over here. So I'm going to try to work my way through some of this. And a lot of this is just junk mail that I know better than to try to keep around. I mean, I honestly know better. And I just be, my thought process is, okay, I'm going to go, I'm going to have time to go through this later and later never comes. And so I just close the door and chuck it. And oh, remind me that I have to make Jackson a doctor's appointment. That was that. That is what that is for. This expires June 16th, so I'm not going over there. I'm not going to spend any money just to save 15%. No, not. Um, okay, nope, that's out. Okay, so we're getting there, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, I need to file that. So I gotta make a couple piles. See, I'm still piling stuff, y'all. I have a piling problem. Okay. Okay. Who, friends? Who? Hmm? Do we know what this is? What is it? Do, do we know? Let me see. I have problems. This is Jackson's tooth. Why? Why am I keeping this? Why? He don't care about his teeth. He don't care. Why? I bought this from the Goodwill, oh my goodness, months ago, months. But I am going to change out my wallet. So I'm gonna be changing out my whole scheme. And so I'm gonna keep this, put it right there because that's gonna be another video. Um, oh man, okay. I bought this for a YouTube video. And I'm not, I, I did the video already. So I'm going to put it down here in the YouTube video pile. I do want to keep these because I have a planner that I... Oh, I write a lot and so I want to write and I use these stickers in there so they are very helpful for me these okay that can go in there but I'm gonna keep that one this is a oh mm. okay huh so this is interesting Just some, some goals I was writing up at the end of 2018 going into 2019. Some things for my channel. Mm. And just some thoughts and ideas. So I'll put that somewhere. And then this is Jackson's notebook for homeschool. Here's your homeschool notebook, Bubba. So I'm going to give that to Jackson, but I'm going to keep this one. Okay, let's see. More pencils and pens. We like a homeschool family around here or something, y'all. Oh, this. Okay, I paid my HOA dues. Paid my dues. So I don't want to hear nothing. They better not come for my life. Let me live. Let me live. Need to file that. All right. We getting somewhere, y'all. This is from... An HOA meeting, trash. 
Uh, oh, I need that. I just started at a, a new school. Well, at three new schools. Okay. Which one of y'all, which one of these do y'all want? These are three pencil sharpeners. Can somebody help me out? You want your own? You want your own? Yeah. No, I do mechanical. Okay. So can you take one of these? Because I cannot have three. Of, well, I don't even use them. Friend. Which one do you want? The yellow. There's two yellow ones. Yellow and blue or yellow and red? Yellow and blue. Okay, come take it. Why, friends? Why? All right. Okay, let's see what this is. This is important information. No, that's still junk mail. Still junk mail. Junk. Goodbye, junk mail. Okay, respond. No. Okay. That is just explanation of benefits. I don't even need that. I don't even need that. I don't I don't need it. Why am I keeping it? Somebody tell me. It's, does it make any sense? Alon, when you get a free second, can you bring my computer here so I can watch it while I'm doing this? Jackson, this right here needs to go into the, um, where the medicines are. It's hydrocortisone. <laughs> trash can underneath the desk part the desk is still very much full of stuff so right now what I've been doing is just cleaning off this part of the desk and tossing a lot of stuff in the trash we put a few things not a lot of stuff actually in the um, file cabinet and so I just have a few more things that I'm still just working to try to find homes for so next I'm actually gonna go through and start working here to see like this is my um, iPad for work so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop it off because I won't need it again until <coughs> hey live your life I won't need this one again until August oh I don't want to unlock it I want to cut it off So I'm just going to cut this off. I'm going to put it into my work bag because I don't need it for right now. So Jackson, put that in mom's work bag. The smile on his face is so priceless because he is almost done with homeschool. We are so almost done with homeschool right now. We live in our best life. <laughs> um, I gave the kids a little bit of extra time this year because traditionally in the past, it has taken Alana a little while longer to get done and I didn't want her to feel overly rushed so I, I scheduled her in some extra days but she actually will be done about four or five days early so that's going to be good for her um, we could have been done a whole lot sooner but again we just had a lot of interruptions this year with some things so I'm thankful that they are done 
So the only thing I'm doing now is I'm actually just tearing up a lot of that junk mail. You know, people be trying to steal your identity and stuff, and I just don't think any of that is appropriate. And then I tear up all my son's credit card offers because he doesn't need a credit card again. Mm -hmm. He won't ever know it came. He never checks his mail when he comes anyway. So if it's something he ordered from Amazon, he'll call and ask about it. If it's not an Amazon thing, he could care less. So what I try to do is keep him from having to make those said decisions because it's not necessary. So again, what I'm doing here now, let me see. Okay, Bubba, this one goes in mom's work bag as well. I never did show you guys my work bag and I'll have to try to remember to show you, but it's very lovely. Um, very lovely. It's I got it from Target. And I love the color. I love everything about it. This is my son's. He never opens this. He never opens his mail. Ever. And he leaves it here for me to deal with. Um, I don't know why they keep sending me stuff I pay online. Like, can you just let me live without you sending me something? But I'm getting through it because I want to be able to use this space. Because right now, I'm so spread out. I'm over on the couch. I'm over by the window. And this is a space that is created for my desk. So I want to be able to use this space um, as much as I possibly can. So what I'm trying to do is go through everything. And just throw away the junk. Throw away the stuff that doesn't mean anything. You know, like junk mail. Why am I holding on? Why? I think it's Catherine from Do It On A Dime or it's Cass from Clutterbug that says put it in one space and deal with it. Fly Lady even says deal with it. You know, one day a week is death day. So I've got to get back to that plan where I'm doing my death day. You know, again, this is more of my son's stuff. He ordered some foolishness. I don't even know what it is. And I'm like, really, son? What is this? Okay, I don't know what any of this is just like. I ordered books for the ladies' meeting. We've already started the ladies' meeting. Uh, oh, okay. I need to file this. I need to file these two things in the file cabinet. Okay, Jack, these will need to go as well, lovely. I still need to, I'm so slack. I need to send this off. Andrea, I have not forgotten. It was just among the things. So I will check to see what the charge is to send this and get it out. I'm sorry. Please forgive. Charge it to my head and not my heart because I honestly um, need to get it done. Here's some hospice stuff. I need to file that as well. Mm. Okay, I need to file that. I made a claim. They paid out on the claim. The, we went to a work trip, and this was like the goodie bags and things that they sent home with us. And none of the stuff in here I can have. Like this candy and stuff. I can't eat any of that. So the whole bag. I mean, it's just, it's... That was, oh. How come I didn't look at this? Oh, this is my tax. Oh, well, okay, y'all. So I've got a little over $18,000 equity in my house. I've been in my house three years. That's pretty good, I guess. Mm, I don't know. Sounds good to me. I know the area where I live is growing up very quickly, and people are, you know, are getting good price for their homes when they're selling. We're not in the market for selling our home or anything, but... Um, I guess that's just interesting. So I'm trying to, definitely just trying to, um, nope, don't need that. Um, somebody passed away. Okay, that was going to file that. Let's see what this, oh, yep, I want to file that too. So those are just things that are going in the file. So again, what, why do I have bags of things? This is my son's. He ordered some burrito blanket. Can we talk, friends? Can we talk? I keep telling him if he wants things to spend money on, just ask me. Ask your mom. I help you. I help you spend all the all the money, all the money, all the things, 
overpayment. Okay. There's another credit card offer. Goodbye, credit cards. We don't need any of them. We are debt free. Dave Ramsey. We don't need it. So we're going to not and say we didn't and move on. He's like, Mom, I know you be ripping up my stuff. I do. You should be here. Be here or not. It's not staying in here. So anywho, I'm making some great progress because a lot of this, again, was just junk. Oh, I didn't even open this. Lord help. Six. Okay. This is from my, um, like I do a prepaid medical card. So they're just sending me the balance, which is only $61. So I knew that one. I knew that was what that was. Oh, y'all, I'm feeling good because I'm getting... Yes, friends. Yes. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. okay. We don't need that either. You're okay. My home report. This is for my utility bill. I have a concern about my bill this month because of the fact that my mom... Oh, okay, it says this month, I'm cooling, lighting, the largest amount is for cooling my home at 61%. We keep it on 76 inside the house. Y'all, if you would go and close those doors as well, it would help keep the utilities down. Yes, friend, somebody uh, sent me some coupons, and I think we're getting ready to have a super doubles. I'm hopeful, anyway, because I need to get all my deals. I've got to get my bill, my grocery bill down. Now, when I do groceries, it does include my toiletries as well. And so I'm getting ready to start back at Walgreens and um, Walgreens and CVS of oh, 621. And I need to be able to save as much as I can on those on those particular you know item things because I definitely need to be able to reduce my out-of-pocket expenses so I'm feeling really good y'all because I'm almost done so I have one thing here that I won't be able to do anything with um, that's this this one right here because my sister is out of town for work, and that's her mail. I went by her house and picked up her mail from her neighbor. I actually need to go back by there and pick up the next set of mail because it's been a couple weeks since I've been by there. Okay, so we are really making a dent because this honestly is the last little bit of it. What I have right here is the last little bit of what was on this table. This whole table is almost totally cleaned. able to just have this tidied up I don't have I have a space for my YouTube stuff which is actually in the front closet but my fear is or my concern is if I put it in the front closet then I'll forget it out of sight out of mind so if I have it out I know that I need to do something with it but then I can't have it out like this so I'm just going to go through this and stack it better to make sure that it's nice and tidy. Anything like bags and stuff that I can get rid of, I will. So I'm just kind of going to go through this really quickly and see how I can just better organize it.
Alrighty, you guys, so there we have it. I have cleaned the vast majority of this. I didn't touch anything on these two shelves because those were fine. I did take the stapler down that was up there, but other than that, I didn't do anything. I did clean this. I'm moving this. Um, but that is clean now. And then everything that was down there that needed cleaning is clean. And then I just straightened this corner up. I got rid of some bags. I got rid of some old boxes. And then I'll be finishing up some reviews here within the next couple of weeks. So you'll be seeing some stuff coming out within the next couple of weeks. So there it is. It took me a minute to just kind of get my thoughts together. I do like the thought of having a a space where I can work. Will it stay this clean all the time? Probably not because again, I'm your, and look at this. Will it stay this clean a lot? No. Because I'm a classic cricket. Again, if I can't get to it right then, I'm just going to put it in here, close the doors, and I'll get to it when I can. But it's clean for now and I'll take it. So anywho, thank you guys so much for stopping by. I hope we motivated you to do a few things in your space. Doesn't have to take long, doesn't have to be perfect, just has to be perfect for you. So anyway, thank you all so much for stopping by our channel. We'll see you next time. Bye now.